Hi, I'm Re from mummyof4.com. I help busy mums make their lives easier with parenting tips, tricks, hacks and advice. Today, I am going to share with you our morning routine on a school morning with four children. If you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell to be notified when I post more videos every week and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Hope you enjoy it. My day starts at about 20 past six. I get up before the children so that I can get ready in relative peace before they all get up. Um, I nip to the loo, wash my face, moisturize, and then pop on some makeup. If you want to see my full makeup routine, including all the different products that I use, I've got a separate video which should be flashing up in your cards now that you can click on. Um, but for the purpose of this video, we're just whizzing right through this part. Um, it is quite nice just to be able to get ready in peace at the beginning of the day before the house descends into chaos. Um, I straighten my hair the morning after I wash it, so not every morning. Um, and if I could be bothered to blow dry it properly the night before, I probably wouldn't even have to do this. Uh, but I'm too lazy to do that and tend to go to bed with wet hair. Once I am ready, I go and wake up the children. Morning, Bella. Come on, darling. Come on, sweetie. Happy cats, come on. Yeah, as you can see, Bella is not great in the mornings. Their uniform is organized as I put it away into everything they need to wear for the day on one hanger. Then I just grab one set of outfit um, and put it out the night before. I then shout up to wake William up and go in and wake Sarah. Hey baby girl, you gonna get up? No. Clearly, none of my children are morning people. Anyway, when Zara does eventually decide that she is happy to get up, uh, it's time to go and change her nappy. She is in cloth nappies and is quite fussy about choosing which nappy she wants to wear. Does she want ponies? Does she want Elmo? So sometimes this takes a bit of time. Um, and then she eventually lets me change her bum. Everyone else uses the bathroom and then gets dressed into the uniform that's been put out for them. Then I do Bella's hair. I have an alarm that goes off at 10 to seven to say it's nearly time to go down for breakfast, then seven o'clock to say, come on, it really is time for breakfast now. Time to go down for breakfast. Yes, and I, and I also got one pound from yeah. the tooth fairy. Yeah. Wow, well done, well. One pound from the tooth fairy. Yes, we're coming down now. So yeah, we all go down the stairs into the kitchen for breakfast. I get everyone to help putting everything out for breakfast. The children have cereal and sugar-free squash or juice. Um, so they start eating their cereal, um, which um, Zara's having Cheerios, uh, so is Bella. The boys are having Weetabix. Um, and then um, while they're eating that, I chop up some fruit for them. Today they are having apple. While the children are finishing up their breakfast, I put on some laundry and sort all that. Our laundry room is just off the kitchen, so I can keep an eye on the children as they eat while I do this. I have got a whole video, which I will link now in the cards, about how I do laundry and the full tour of our laundry room. So uh, in the mornings, I make sure that um, I've emptied the dryer, I have um, put a new load in the washing machine, um, I, there we go, this is the stuff I use in the washing machine. This is all linked in my laundry room tour video, which um, you should go and check out when you've finished watching this. As you can imagine, with a family of six, I have a lot of laundry, so getting this job done while they're eating really works for me. Um, I then have a little bit of um, a tidy uh around the kitchen. I spray the sink with a bit of Zoflora, um, and I do quite like to put a cap full of Zoflora into the sink. I'm quite liking Linen Fresh at the moment, along with some boiling water to disinfect it, and the house smells amazing when I get home. I pop an Exanti meal replacement bar into my bag for when I get to school. I tend to eat that in the car and it just saves time. It's the kind of breakfast I'm preferring at the moment. Then I get everyone to help clear away the breakfast things and the little ones and uh, my eldest clean their teeth downstairs. Um, I find it just much easier for them to do that uh, downstairs in the morning rather than traipsing them all the way back up the stairs. When they have finished their teeth, they, um, the middle two, William and Bella, go and play and watch some TV in the playroom. And I take Zara 
back upstairs because she needs um, another clean nappy and changing. She's far too messy to eat breakfast in her clean clothes. So I go around upstairs, opening all the blinds, tidying up a little bit, making beds and just sort of making the house just semi-tidy for the day really. If I'm making the beds, it just makes a whole massive difference to the house. Um, I seem to be the only one that does it. I need to get the children to up there making the bed game really. Um, so yeah, I make all the beds um, and then I will clean my teeth um, and then once I've cleaned my teeth, I will do my lips with a little bit of uh, MAC lip liner and lipstick for the day. Um, and spray on what my daughter's called spray on neck, which normally the girls want a bit of that too if they're anywhere around. I change Zara's bum and dress her and do her hair into her signature bunches before it is time to go downstairs. I have an alarm at quarter to eight that says, come on, shoes and coats guys, for the little ones to start getting ready. And then another one at five to eight that says, right, it's actually time to get in the car now. And that is what we do every single morning before the children go to school and Zara and I can then come back and start our day. So that is our school morning routine. If you have liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos every week and hit the bell to be notified when I post more videos. Thank you so much, bye.